Hello, this is my final monthly video blog update for the month of August from my HTM field study at Seabrook Island Club in Charleston, South Carolina. Um, for the month of August, I worked 30.73 hours, which brings my total hours for my field study to 460.82 hours, so hit well over that 400 hour mark. Um, I still don't have any questions, comments, or concerns. Um, but yeah, so I only worked four days in the month of August, um, but had a great few of them finishing up in the F&B department. Um, I also got to go to my last intern class for the summer, which was a really cool aspect of the internship. This one was on operational leadership and management. Um, got to learn about the different type of management types, like the cheerleader, the dictator, the coach. Um, and that was led by my HR director, uh, the food and beverage manager, and then our um, the club general manager. Um, but I also got to complete and present my case study to those supervisors um, that I had the class with and that kind of um, led the program all summer. Um, but for the case study that they assigned to us that we got to do, um, it was basically two parts. The first was a financial analysis and one where I got to look at the financial statements for the club for 2018 as well as the budget for 2019 and kind of look over them. A lot of what I did in um, financial management of hospitality organizations. Thank you, Professor Walton, for all the good stuff I learned there that got to help on this part. Um, and then the second part was human resources scenarios in which I got to like evaluate and basically make a write-up on how if I were the HR manager in those positions like how I'd handle them um, so I thought both parts of the case study were really cool because it felt like I was putting on like a manager's hat um, and kind of doing tasks analysis that I would be in a managerial role um, so yeah, I thought that was really great because I got to give it to them and present it and get some feedback from them on that. Um, but all in all, it was a really great summer getting to work and live in Charleston. Um, Seabrook is a great place. The people there really made me feel like family and it was hard to leave. Um, but I came out with a lot of great experience and more of a feel of where I'd like to take my career after graduation this year. Um, but yeah, signing off for good. Also, if you want to see a really funny video of my last day at Seabrook, uh, check out the next video after this. Oh, oh my god! You're an idiot. <laughs> Why would you even do that? You're so stupid. Oh. <laughs> see you later. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Did you just drown? <laughs> Somebody get her a towel. <laughs>